What's up guys, it's your boy DS, and today we're going to be talking about Hufflepuff. I am going to be giving you guys some information, and then you can decide for yourself if this is the house that you want to join. Now before we get into that, I do want to say I appreciate the support on the last couple of videos so much. You guys have been showing so much support, it's crazy. And I do read all of my comments, so I know a lot of y'all have been asking where the Hufflepuff video's at. And for some reason, some people thought that I didn't like the other houses, which isn't true. I just, you know, I have to get to all of them, so I apologize. Anyway, with all that out of the way, let's go ahead and get into the uh, professors. And the first professor we're going to be talking about is Professor Mirabel Garlic. Professor Garlic is actually an English muggle-born witch, and she teaches herbology at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. She has a very sunny demeanor and uses flowery language, charming her colleagues and students alike considered to be a very kind and caring person. As a professor of herbology, she is very accomplished and knowledgeable when it comes to magical plants. The next professor we're gonna be talking about is Bai Hoenn, and she teaches beasts at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. To give you a little more information about what the beast class teaches, you will learn about a variety of magical beasts you might encounter both at the school and as you explore the world surrounding the castle and its grounds. Another name for this class would also be Care of Magical Creatures. Professor Hoenn believed beasts were useful for protective clothing, potion ingredients, and even wand cores. She wanted future generations to believe this fact as well. Now that we're done talking about the two professors, I want to get into the companion that you will see at Hufflepuff, and her name is Poppy Sweeting. Like most Hufflepuff, Poppy has a heart of gold. She is a sweet, bright, compassionate girl who feels more comfortable among magical beasts than humans. She has a particular aversion to poachers of magical creatures and those that work with them. And if you want to know the traits of a Hufflepuff, they're known for being the most inclusive house to invite anyone who valued hard work. The students of Hufflepuff House are generally thought of as good-natured and pride themselves on patience, loyalty, and fair play. While not as ambitious or competitive as the other houses, they are tried and true and still capable of great things, even if they aren't likely to boast about their accomplishments. Founded by Helga Hufflepuff, the house is emblazoned by a badger alongside the colors of yellow and black. Now, as you guys can see, Professor Garlic clearly has some type of influence on the Hufflepuff house because as you're walking through there, you will see a lot of different plants and things like that. On top of, it kind of has a very homely and cozy type of vibe going on. On top of the colors being primarily yellow in the common room, you'll notice it just has a very nice and comfortable feeling to it, opposed to some of the other houses. So if any of this sounds like a place that you want to go to, maybe Hufflepuff is the place for you. But anyway, that is going to be it for this video. Be sure to give it a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new, comment down below, tell me what you guys said in the comment section below. With that being said, I will see you guys next time. Peace.